I regularly hit more than 25,000 steps a day. But that's because I run more than 15 miles. What do you need to do to get to 20,000 steps without running? And how many calories does it burn? Let's find out. I actually have no idea where to go on an hour's walk because I know exactly where I'm going to end up on an hour's run. Because I've got no idea where I'm going and I'm double backing on myself, I look like such a weirdo. I've just turned back twice and now it looks like I'm following a woman. We could only manage 30 minutes with all my faffing around with the camera and all that kind of stuff and uh, maybe oversleeping by about 15 minutes. We could only get 30 minutes. That's okay. Which means we've got to work harder the rest of the day to get it in. I need to try and squeeze in as many walks as I can during the work day. So, out here now, early morning. 8 a.m. Get in a quick one, it is raining. But the sunrise is spectacular. All right, so it's the lunchtime break. I would normally be running right now. And instead, we're doing the walk. <clears throat> it's a speedy walk. We're at 8,600 steps. We'll need that to increase a bit, but we're, we're getting there. I guess if we get halfway by midday, the rest of the day, we just need to do what we've done. By my calculations, it's gonna take about four hours of walking to get to 20,000 steps. And when you got full-time job and kids, you know, four hours is a big chunk of your day. Could be difficult to get it in. Because I've got a desk job, what I've been doing today is rather than sending emails, I'm just getting up and going to see the people. Most of the time they're down the other side of the office, but you know, I don't necessarily need the answer now. That's kind of the feeling people get when you go to speak to them is that you need the answer now, I don't. I'm just trying to get my steps in. And then also, when I need to go to the toilet, I'll find the toilet that's the furthest away from me. Right now, my heart rate is around 90 beats per minute. This morning, it was around 100 beats per minute, which is actually pretty good going because um, that's a really slow, slow jog, or a really slow place, a really slow pace on the, uh, the spin bike, which is a nice fat burning zone, to be honest. I will say that walking is actually getting me a nice little sweat on. <laughs> uh, when I had my coat on this morning, I was far too hot. I was sweating. The temperature is about 10, 11 degrees right now, slightly windy, uh, but yeah, got trousers on and big boots, but they're not heavy boots, but definitely getting a sweat on. And now I'm going uphill, so 104 beats per minute, we get in there. One of the afternoon. It's home time and it's already getting dark. It's 3.30 and we still need to get some water. Let's 
going to be hard because my partner works nights, nice, so she needs to go for a sleep while I take care of the kids. So I think it's going to be a park run. The step count at the minute is just over 14,500 and I've got 5,000 more steps to go. So we're quickly losing light. So kids, yeah. let's go to the park. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, tidy this mess. Let's go. <laughs> Okay, we absolutely ran out of light. Thankfully, I've got enough torches and bike lights to keep me going, but it is dark. Got to walk around in a circle of the park now for about 30 minutes, whilst also juggling, hearing daddy, daddy, play, play, do this, do this, push me, push me, pull me, spin me. I guess it's all part of the fun. Over 30 minutes now, and we're still not at 20,000. I thought we were going to be there by now. We're at about 17,000. I reckon, I can't see a thing. I reckon we're going to be another 10, 15 minutes of walking around in a bloody circle. Okay, it's been 50 minutes. I feel like we're starting to get excessive now, so it's time to go. So we are home and we are finished. That's right, 20,669 steps. Just over three hours of total walking time. 1,480 calories burnt for the day and just over 11 miles walked. Honestly, I thought this was gonna be way more difficult than it actually was. Granted, when I was on my walk, I was ripping and rolling. I wasn't hanging around and my heart rate for a walk was right up there. And it's everything you can do too. So now go and watch this video where I did the Andrew Huberman sleep protocol and found out exactly what percentage you can improve your sleep by.